your pipeline will fail in production even if you change nothing and the first time it happens people will treat like it's your fault if you are a new data engineer this is the fastest way to lose the trust and also maybe your job i will show you most common production problems a new data engineer generally face and how to avoid it i am not going to do theory this is a real job stuff for each of the problem i will show you how it shows up why it happens what to do today and what to implement permanently let's start with the biggest one the schema drift you open airflow and see a red task spark error says something like cannot resolve the column field not found cannot cast string into integer or worse job success but half your column becomes null why it happens upstream teams change things without telling you they might have renamed customer id to cust id a number becomes a string next json changes the shape this is called schema drift and in production it's not will it happen it's when it will happen what to do today step 1 confirm schema change compare today's input schema versus yesterday's if you do not have tooling even a quick sample read or trend schema will work step 2 don't let bad records poison your current data you have two safe choices fail fast with clear error schema mismatch or quarantine the unexpected records to a bad records bucket so business doesn't get corrupted data first the schema validation at ingestion second quarantine path for bad records and third thing version schema in git so schema changes happens via pr not surprise senior engineer don't hope schema won't change they design pipelines assume it will change problem 2 missing partition or late arriving data what it look like job starts on time but input isn't ready you see no file found row count is suddenly zero dashboards refresh with the partial data and now everyone blames your pipeline why it happens because schedules are time based but data arrival is not upstream systems got delayed network issues source jobs failed or data arrives in pieces what to do today as a new data engineer try to do this don't publish curated output if input is incomplete add a completeness check expected partitions exist file count row count above minimum or compare against yesterday's range so you get a tentative idea maintain a simple watermark last successful partition date so if late data comes you can rerun only the missing window what to implement permanently permanent fix build a rerun window example every day you process today's data and last three days data so if data arrives late your pipeline self fills without manual fire fighting time based scheduling is cheap database scheduling is professional problem 3 permissions and secrets expired this one is painful because it makes you doubt yourself works on your laptop works in development fails only in production with errors like access denied permission denied token expired 403 unauthorized what not why it happens production has different roles policies network rules secret rotation schedules and many organization rotates secrets silently your job breaks overnight what to do today check the following which identity ran the job what resources is blocked is it the new path table check the secret age last rotation what to implement permanently permanent fix is not give admin access it's a pre deploy checklist correct iam roles services account correct paths list privilege but complete permissions secret rotation handle via secret manager if production access isn't automated and documented it will break again these are the three most common production problems that a new data engineer generally face it is start with this schema drift then the late or missing data then it about the permissions and the secrets notice the pattern production issues are usually not about the code they are about the constraints timings and the excesses comment if you have faced any of these issues in your production till then follow data with pranjal